Hi guys, it's Royce from Rita Highs. Today, I'll be talking about the property tax hike in 2023 and 2024. Firstly, this property tax hike will be an, is announced in February 2022 SG budget that the property tax hike will be coming in in 2023 and 2024. So, for a disclaimer, this is actually for educational and reference purposes. If you need to make any decision on your property choices, please do your own research or consult an expert to guide you along. So what are the changes in this coming hikes in 2023 and 2024? Firstly, the owner-occupied residential property tax has increased for any annual value more than 30,000. It has increased from 4 to 16% to 6 to 32%. For non-owner-occupied uh, residential property tax, it has actually increased from 10 to 20% up to 12 to 36% tax. So, uh, who are actually affected by this uh, property tax hike? Firstly, is the owner-occupied housing that the annual value are more than 30,000 affected. So, the only one who are affected are actually the top 7% owner-owned occupied properties in Singapore. So, the rest of the 93% property owners are actually not affected that tremendously by the property tax hike. So the table below is actually uh, announced in uh, MOF to show you that the tax differences is coming uh, to change. The differences actually starts after the first 30,000 of the annual value. So uh, illustration on uh, how the calculation is done that you can see that if it's a HDB owner with an annual value of $11,000. The property tax payable is $121.60 currently. And in the future, the next calculation, based on the stable, there's actually no much, no changes for any annual value less than $30,000. So the property tax are not affecting the HDB owners. So for owner-occupied condominium, in the central area with the annual value slightly above $30,000. Currently, the property tax is $1,280. In 2023, it will increase to $1,380, a $100 increase. And in 2024, it will increase even further to $1,480, which is $200 more than this year. Lastly, for a owner-occupied landed property owners in central area with an annual value up to 70000 The property tax they are payable now is $2,780. However, with the new uh, property tax uh, heights coming up in, in 2023, the tax payable will be $3,930, $1,150 more compared to this year. So in 2024, the tax will be revised again to a higher tax rate so, however, the tax rate will be paying up to $5,080. It's a $2,300 more than this year. So, next we are going to non-owners occupied residential property tax. So, it will affect all non-owners property tax regardless of the annual value. So, the uh, table below is actually showing you the difference that the tax height is increasing from uh, up to 36% by end of 2024. So an illustration of the calculation on how the annual value and the property tax is calculated for uh, the non-owner occupied properties. Firstly, if you have an annual value property of $10,000, your current property tax is actually based on $1,000 per annum. In 2023, it will be increased to $1,100, a $100 increase. In 2024, it will be increased to $1,200, a $200 increase. For a non uh for a non owner occupied condominium, which is an annual value of thirty thousand at the borderline, which is we are talking about, the current property tax payable is actually three thousand dollars. However, in twenty twenty three, it will increase to three thousand three hundred dollars, and in twenty twenty four, it will be increased to three thousand six hundred dollars. The difference will be about three hundred in twenty twenty three and six hundred twenty in twenty twenty four. Lastly. Uh, annual value more than thirty thousand, breaking the first uh first uh first thirty thousand. 
For a non-owner occupied condominium where annual value more than thirty thousand, which is forty thousand, your property tax is currently four thousand two hundred dollars per annum. In twenty twenty three, the property tax will be recalculated to four thousand nine hundred dollars, which is seven hundred dollars more than this year. In twenty twenty four, the property tax will be increased again. So you will have to pay a five thousand six hundred dollars property tax in twenty twenty four for the same property, which is a one thousand four hundred dollars increase comparing to twenty twenty two. So in the conclusion, in the Singapore real estate market, Singapore actually have fairly good track record of our property market in terms of long term growth and a hedge to inflation. So most of the owners and Investors are not strongly affected by this property tax hike, as they have a long-term view, and it's actually a great wealth preservation way in Singapore. Singapore remains attractive to real estate investment with its stable currency and political environment. Guys, thank you for watching. I hope you understand what is the property tax going to affect us in the late coming years in twenty twenty three and twenty twenty four. So, if you need to make any uh, decision or get any help in your property decision, call me today to arrange your personal consultation to make your important right choice. Bye.